Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on this makeup look that I'm calling the classic Instagram makeup look because I'm using a lot of um, techniques that you see on Instagram and I feel like the eyes especially and the brows are kind of Instagrammy. But yeah, I'm just going to show you guys how to get this look. It's still quite simple but yet glam at the same time. Um, I'm using this pore smasher by banish that um, was kindly sent to me by them i love this to put it in the freezer and just like massage my face with it i moisturized my skin and then i'm color correcting with the makeup forever cream camouflage palette and i'm using the orange shade around my mouth area and then for foundation i'm using the nars sheer glow foundation in tahoe and i'm just going to buff this into my skin i'm using the real techniques buffing brush and i really want full coverage so i did Put, um, quite a lot on my face and um, then for brows I'm using the soap and glory brow archery pencil in dark chocolate and I'm just going to really define my eyebrows especially on the outer point and the arc I actually don't really have that much of an arc so I actually make it with a pencil and then I'm using this NYX sculpt and highlight duo um, in the shade peach and cinnamon I believe and I'm using the peach shade to carve out my brows and really clean it up I'm also using the peach under my eyes and I'm doing this really dramatic you know highlight and contour that you see a lot on Instagram and I think it's so so fun like it's so fun to just draw it all on your face and just blend it all out so I'm using the cinnamon shade on my forehead um, I'm also doing a bit of contouring with it and I did it um, on my jawline as well. I did go in with my beauty blender to blend out the highlighted part and then I went in with the foundation brush actually. I did start with the beauty blender but I went in with my brush, my foundation brush just to blend out the contour. It was so much easier and yeah I really love this NYX duo. It's so so nice to use and it doesn't dry my skin out as well. Now onto baking, I'm going to be using the Benai Banana Powder um, and I'm going to use this under my eyes. I'm using these sponges that I got from Boots and I'm applying a lot under my eyes and also carving my cheekbones with it, well under the contour just to define it a bit more. And then once I said let that sit for a few seconds, I'm just going to brush it all off. I did brush it all over my lids as well just to set the concealer. And there you go, it gives such a flawless base. And it's definitely something that you see on Instagram a lot. Then I just set my eyebrows with some Estee Lauder Brow Gel in Dark Brunette and then I'm going to be using this NYX Pro Contour and Highlight Palette and I used the Cool Tone Brown in the palette just to contour my cheeks and set the cream contour in place as well. And the brush I'm using for this is the Makeup Revolution uh, Angled Face Brush which is really nice for contouring. Then for blush I'm going to be using the EX1 Cosmetics blush in natural flush I believe and lightly dust that over my cheeks and then onto the eyes I'm using the Anastasia eyeshadow in Morocco and uh, roughly um, blending this into my crease. I then use the shadow called Pink Champagne on my lid and I just put this on my finger you really don't need to be neat with it but just make sure to keep it on the um, mobile lid only and I went in with the Anastasia shadow in fudge these are like a few of my favorite Anastasia shadows um, and I just love to go for this kind of eyeshadow look and the fudge I only kept it on the um, outer third of my eyelid and then for liner I'm using the NYC liquid eyeliner that you see a lot in my tutorials it's so nice to use on the lid because it's super matte and I just did a classic wing liner look with that and I'm going on to my lower lash line and I'm using the same shades uh, Morocco and Fudge on my lower lash line and I put some mascara on as well. I did put a thin layer on my top lashes because we are going to be using my Classy Lashes UK Mink Lashes. These are super long and fluttery so I thought it was really fitting for this look and I do have a coupon code with Classy Lashes UK which will be in the info box if you guys are interested. And then I jumped onto my lips, I'm using the uh, MAC Lip Pencil in Spice and then I am going to be using the Lime Crime Liquid Lipstick in Shroom. And this is, this is just giving me my perfect nude lipstick which I thought goes well with this look. And then to finish off everything, I'm highlighting my skin with the Becca Champagne Pop Highlighter and I'm not holding myself back on this. I highlighted the heck out of my face because you guys know this is super popular. 
but yeah that's all I did for this makeup look I really had so much fun doing this and um, don't take it too seriously I was just very inspired by all the makeup looks and the Instagram videos that you see on Instagram so I thought I'll create this look and um, please hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel and if you like the video hit the thumbs up button I love you guys and I will see you all in my next video bye